Yo, what's up everybody? I was talking about uh, boxing again. And I was saying with a guy who's up in weight class, they usually don't take their punching power with them. And I was saying how Floyd Mayweather came in at 131. His first set was at 131, then 135. I think it was 135, I'm not sure. But 140, 147. When guys move up in weight class, they generally don't take their punching power with them. And all them guys that fight at 147 are usually guys that move up from smaller weight classes. Like Cotto came up from 135. Phil LaHoya came up from 130, I think it was. Um, Floyd Mayweather fought his first fight at 131. They smaller and they move up to 147 because that's where bigger money is more money up there. But they don't generally take their punch and power with them. It's just like De La Hoya, he moved up and tried to fight Bernard Hopkins and look what happened to him. He got stopped by Bernard Hopkins. Uh, Shiver Lennox moved up and he fought Donnie Lalonde and he fought Marvin Hagler. He stopped Donnie Lalonde. But Don, your grandmother could beat Donnie Lalonde. But uh, Marvin, you seen when Sugar Lennon was hitting Marvin Hagler, it didn't even look like the punches was phasing, phasing Marvin Hagler. He outboxed Marvin Hagler. He tripped him and did all that, uh, you know, ring gestures and shit like that. And he beat him on a scorecard. But if he was just standing there trying to slug it out with him, he'd have got knocked out. Just like Tommy Hearns tried to slug it out with Marvin Hagler. And look what happened to him. Boxers move up in weight class. They don't take their punch and power with them. Tommy Hearns is a prime example of a guy that moved up to 160 and tried to fight Marvin Hagler. De La Hoya moved up from 147 and tried to fight Bernard Hopkins, and he got knocked out. Now, Roberto Duran beat Iran Barkley, but, you know, Iran Barkley wasn't in tip-top shape and shit like that, and Iran Barkley wasn't going in there slugging it out with Duran like he should have. And, uh, who is that? Trinidad beat uh, William Joppy. William Joppy was fighting the whole damn fight with his hands down. He got knocked out. Yeah.